Hey, what's up guys, Keenan here. And today we are measuring my body fat percentage with the with these uh, skin fold calipers. So today I'm gonna do the three, uh, today I'm gonna do the three sight method. So um, it's gonna be different for women, but for men, the three sight method is gonna be right here. So right here in the side of your chest, that's gonna be your first skin fold. Then you're gonna go right here, right beside the belly button. About like that. And then you're also gonna do the thigh, which I have pants on right now, so I can't pull those down for this video. But that's gonna be the method we're gonna to use today to see what my body fat percentage is. Now yesterday I did it a few times. I did the seven site method. I did the three site method a few times and I got anywhere from 13 to 15% as my body fat percentage, which is probably pretty accurate. I mean, you can kind of see my abs. I'm not shredded. Um, I'm actually really cold right now because I'm out in the garage and it's like 40 some degrees outside. So it's freezing out here. I got my little, uh, got my little really small space heater going. But anyway, I want to come out and make this video. So we will hit these sites real quick and see. And then I will uh, put my measurements into my phone and I will then put a, I'll put a screenshot up here so you guys can see the results and then you can also see the website and the calculator I use to figure out my body fat percentage so with these skin fold calipers I can't even remember where I got them I, I probably just got them on Amazon or something so you close them you turn them on and then it says zero so we're going to millimeters right now So it's kind of hard to do on yourself, especially the seven site method you can't do on your own. But the three site method you can do on your own, it's just a little harder to do. So we'll go ahead and do this. So here's our first spot. So we got about 11.8. So I'm gonna do it a few times just so we can get an average and make sure that we're getting a good measurement. Thirteen. Twelve. So it's around twelve is gonna be the average for that one. Next we're gonna hit the stomach. <clears throat> Grab a piece right there. About 19. Twenty-one. Twenty. Took so about twenty for that. Now we'll do the thigh. 12, 20, and then 13 on the thigh. So I'm gonna put those into the calculator real quick and see what we come up with. All right, so here we are guys. I added in my three sites and it's saying that I'm at about a 12.8% body fat, which I don't know. So I'm not sure how accurate that is. I'd say I'm anywhere from I'd say I'm probably around 13, 14%. Um, that might be pretty accurate though, 12.8, because it is morning. I'm still pretty dehydrated. I'm a little bit dry compared to what I'd be like later in the day after consuming sodium and food and drinking a lot of fluids. So that might actually be more accurate around a 12.8%. So, 
My goal is to reach 10%. I want to get below 10% so that you can see uh, my abs very well. And then I want to keep going down 9, 8, 7, and see how shredded I can get while also maintaining as much muscle as possible. My weight right now is 186, about 185, 185 to 186 right in the morning. And then throughout the day, it goes up to about 188, 189 after eating and taking in fluids and stuff. So, but my goal is to get down to like 8% body fat, which I need to lose about 5%. So that's going to be about eight, nine pounds, which would put me down to about 178, 177. But at the same time, I'm trying to build muscle too. So I'd like to stay around 180, um, below 10% body fat, keep my body weight around 180, get my lean, uh, get my lean mass up above 160 pounds and we'll go from there and see what I look like so <clears throat> so yeah, this is what I look like guys or just right in the morning cold I did one set of dips and I did one set of leg lifts for my abs and that's all I've done so far so I have so I'm cold. I'm actually literally cold because it's like 45 degrees out here. So I'm cold. I don't have anywhere near a pump. And I'm actually pretty happy with my physique and my progress so far. So if you guys have been following me and watching my videos, then you can probably see the changes I've made so far. I've I've lost a couple pounds. I've lost maybe two pounds, but I've actually probably dropped 3% body fat. So I know that I'm heading in the right direction. I'm maintaining muscle, if not building some muscle and losing fat at the same time. So thanks for watching guys. That's going to be it for this one. We'll catch you in the next video.